Hello everybody, this is Exligent Sniper X42 here with yet another one of my commentaries, you guessed it. This match here uh, with the M16 and the M93 Rafika. Starting the match, you know, walk into that, walk into that. Wow. Hmm. Sounded really gay. Yeah, so just, as always, since, you know, we're not maxed out, just, you know, starting the match by capping, but whenever I do max out, like, or if I hit 55, I'm starting, wow, sorry, I'm still on COD 4 mindset, because I was just working on there, trying to get another commentary into my archive. Alright, so what normally happens is that once I hit around, I think it's 70, um, I just, I stick there for a little bit, don't even bother capping, just go for kills and KD, kills and KD, over and over. Right here, just protecting B by that guy under the train. Now a little bit delayed, sidetracked. And a little nice spray two-piece right there. Get both those guys. And this is a great, oh god, I'm gonna say this is a, this is a very good camping spot, all right? Because in this spot, you can see pretty much what happens all around you. Except, I think, all the way to the side, that if you look on the map, it's to the bottom, or to the left, or right, right now. Over there, that's the only, that's your only blind spots, and people can come in from there. But, as you can see, I set, uh, set, I set some claymores here, just get it all prepped up, and I get shot, but I think I take about... I'll take a couple guys down with me, not that bad. Alright. So then what I what I you know would like to do. Um just you know play it a bit cautious and just saying yes my name is legit sniper, so I'm using the M sixteen, but you'll see later on it'll just turn it turn into me using a Kimbo uh, M ninety threes. Or as most people know them, the Rafika. But the Rafika sounds kind of gay to me, so I say M93 because it looks like the M9 pistol, just a three-shot burst. But that is actually, yeah, this is, this is the gun, and I normally don't like this akimboed. When it's akimboed, I don't know, I just don't like because I think that it just sprays a bit too much. But get the nice little two spray right there, which I guess could be helpful. But if I would use this, I'd try not to use steady aim because you kind of need enough. You know, an open spray with it, I guess. I don't know. Right, so in this match, I think I have Scavenger, as you can see with all my Claymore placing and kiting. Oh god, that's a wow term. Ugh. Alright, <laughs> yeah. So in kiting, for all you non RPG players, is when you shoot or when you plant a trap or like a Claymore, and then you pretty much wait. I think later on in this game, you'll see a lot of me doing that. I'll kill a guy, I pick up the other claymore. Right now, here's the kiting part. I take out one. And you'll see them, they'll start coming up. But I almost get killed by that Semtex, which is not very good. And see, there goes the claymore. I get the scavenger claymore, and I place down another. Oh, and there goes the other one that I placed. And this technique works very well. Just chill near a set of stairs that are commonly used. And just use this up. It's really helpful. Because every time somebody comes up, it just seems to work. Alright, then I think I die over here. I, I'm pretty sure. But I end the match 47 and 4. So that's not too bad. But I had a lot of fun doing this match. It was just kind of like a screw around match. You know, as you can see, I'm using the M16. So uh, you can kind of figure that I didn't really, you know, try to do much here. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, yeah, sorry about that. Uh, yeah, my mic gets a bit messed up every once in a while. So just kind of bear with me here. Alright, so right here I get a, you know, I think there's a, yep, three piece. Just going after it. Just keep the shots going just wherever you think they are shoot because if you're shooting there and in a group of people or even if it's just one person you're probably gonna hit them it's a machine gun so you can it's very lenient oh my god I said lenient and a nice little wall bang here by a uh, well with the Rafikas as you can see 
Sorry, I'm kind of tired right now. I'm doing this uh, late at night, and I've, I haven't put up a lot of stuff on YouTube lately. Because I've had a lot of stuff going on. So I, YouTube hasn't been my main priority because i got finals and regents, and it's not fun. But I'm going to be hoping to put some more stuff up. Like, after this commentary, I was keeping them coming because i got a bunch more good matches that I can always do. So... And this isn't even my best one. I got, I think, a couple more better than this with a sniper. Okay. And at this point, I'm completely frantic, saying, Oh my god, oh my god, don't die. Because as you can see, you can see the blood splatter everywhere, and there goes my uh, Harriers. I think, yes, Harriers. And then, let's see, the one, and then the painkiller. Ew. Then I get a knife right there, which, not that bad place in the claymore in case people follow me because you know what I'm going for the nuke I'm going all the way balls to the wall hmm that also sounded weird oh well oh right, yeah I'm gonna take a poll uh yeah what a uh, bunch of my friends are saying that I should have a catchphrase so if anybody could just come up with them and I, I'm just curious to see what you guys would say because I know it's gonna be something perverted but I, I'm curious now and right here getting the chopper gunner then I do work Chopper Gunner is absolutely one of the best and most overpowered kill streaks in the game. Because you can pretty much shoot through anything. As you can see, I shot a guy through a building before. Let's see, I'm not even going to bother counting. You guys can count this. It's like absolute spawn rape over there. Let's just keep it going. Oh, and also, um, one thing I didn't say, uh, this might be, well, the audio for the actual game might be a bit messed up because I use Wii game because Fraps doesn't work on my computer I, I have the full cracked version but when it goes oh, sometimes it'll work sometimes it won't and when it does work my uncompressed file size for about 45 seconds is maybe like half a gig at 60 FPS and, uh, and my compression program isn't working so I don't know what to say and right now, as you can see, I am kind of freaking out because I almost got it. And this guy almost kills me. And that's my nuke right there. That is my nuke. And then that guy's like, and at this point, they're kind of starting to realize that I get a nuke. And as you can see, I'm kind of running around like a retard, like, woohoo, nuke. But then I just keep it going. It's like, you know what? You might as well wait till a bit later in the match. Might as well. Nothing wrong with that. But then, look, the match is almost over. We're winning at 197. And I forgot to put, I almost forget to put it out. And there it is. End of the game. Finishing it off. Actually, just finishing shit off. And there I go. I get killed. And there is my absolutely awesome nuke. Alright. So you know what you guys could do to really help? You could comment, rate, and, well, no more rating. I guess thumbs up or like. I, oh, I don't know. It's all gay. And make sure to subscribe, right? That's what keeps me going. All right. Peace.